Hey everybody, this is Mark. Um, so you've just downloaded the new OnD Pro firmware and now you're trying to figure out what to do with this zip folder that you've downloaded. Um, what you're going to do is you need to extract this zip folder and inside it are two files and you need to put those on an SD card. You need an SD card that is a minimum of 4 gigabytes and a maximum of 32 gigabytes. Um, so as you can see here, I've already downloaded the OnD Pro uh, zip file. It's on the left here on the left side of my screen. Um, I just downloaded it to the desktop on my computer. And on the right hand side here is my four gigabyte SD card. Um, it already has a folder on it that I just have some apps in. That's fine. You can have a folder on the SD card. Um, we just don't recommend any loose files in here. A folder is fine like that, but any loose files can be an issue. Because when you extract these two files out of the OnD Pro zip folder, you are going to paste them directly to the SD card. You don't want them in any other folders. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and show you how to do that. Um, if you don't already have an extracting program, uh, Windows 10 does come with an extracting program built in. Um, but if you don't have one, we recommend a program called 7-Zip. Um, when you downloaded the firmware, we, you would have seen in the instructions a link to download it. 7-Zip um, is a very small program, very easy to use. So I'm going to go ahead and right click now on the zip folder that I downloaded. So I right click on it. And in the drop down here, as you can see, there's an extract all button here. But I'm going to use 7-Zip because I have it. And I'm just going to click, scroll down here and click extract to on dpro. Okay, so what that's going to do now is it's creating an on dpro folder here. And when it's finished, I will open that folder to show you what's inside it. Okay, so it's now finished extracting, and it took approximately one minute to do so. Okay, so now I'm going to double click on the OnD Pro folder that was just created. And inside here, you have a recovery file and a TWRP folder, twerp. Um, the twerp folder, as you can see, is 2.22 gigabytes, and the recovery is just a 10 megabyte file. So what you're now going to do is you want to take these two and copy them and paste them over to your SD card. So to do that, you just click on one of them once. You don't want to double click. Just click on it to highlight it. And then hold down shift on your keyboard and then click on the other one. And you'll have both of them highlighted. Then you can right click on them and click copy. And then on your SD card on the other side, you want to click once to highlight the folder, the um, SD card over here. And then right click and then click paste. And as you can see now, it is beginning to paste. Okay, so now this process is finished. It took about five minutes for it to copy and paste. Um, but now you'll see the recovery and the TWRP folder are now over here on my SD card. Okay, so now your card is ready um, to put into your box and get ready to flash your box. Um, just follow the instructions again on the website and uh, just follow along with your SD card ready to go. Okay, thanks very much.